Hello, I'm Mel Stride and I'm Chair of the Treasury Select Committee and a Member of Parliament for Central Devon. And it's been a matter of great pride to me that the Treasury Select Committee has been one of the six committees that commissioned the work that you have been carrying out. The government has very significant uh, aspirations uh, for tackling climate change, including the achievement of net zero by 2050. But we need to know exactly how we're going to get there, how we're going to achieve that vital goal. And that's where your work has been so important. The Treasury Select Committee itself has launched an inquiry into decarbonisation and green finance, because we recognise that the Treasury and the financial system in our country plays a huge part in determining whether we will achieve that goal of net zero by 2050. So we're interested in the basis on which companies and banks lend, we're interested in finance, and we're interested in the financial incentives that there might be to further encourage green development. But we can't do all of that alone, and we recognise that the work that you've done has been extremely important. I've been particularly interested in the work that's been carried out around the issue of fairness, about who should actually pay for the investment required for us to achieve a green economy. And the sessions that you've had on in the home and on travel, I think, has been particularly interesting. What I will ensure is that when your report is published, I will make sure that every member of the Treasury Select Committee receives a copy of that. And I will further make sure that the government and ministers are fully aware of all the recommendations that you make. So can I thank you all once again for the huge amount of work that you have put into this really important project, important for all of us, important for a green economy, and for making sure that we leave a better planet for our children and all who follow.